the world knows about tea. But let me see how much do you really know about tea. Well, there are more than 3,000 varieties of teas, but you really know all the teas come from one plant, which is Camellia sinensis. Then how it's further processed gets classified into different varieties, which is black tea, green tea, white tea, and many more teas like that. However, herbal teas are made using a combination of spices, bark, flowers, leaves, etc. All from non-tea plants. So by nature, it makes them caffeine-free. Let's understand a herbal tea better. Let's get going. Hi guys, I'm Umang and I welcome you to my channel Involve Evolve. It's all about health and beauty here and today we're discussing herbal tea. There are many varieties of herbal teas and just like any other herb, every herbal tea has its own specific benefits and some of the herbal teas are my favorite and one of them is dandelion tea. Maybe because it's like it has its detoxing nature. I mean, I have faced this bloating issue for years. And when I started taking this one, it came as a surprise to me. Um, of course, it's not a replacement for any bad diet that you may take. Then that leads to uh, bloating. And of course, especially this high salt intake diet, you may want to avoid that. But other than that, if you have issues like bloating, water retention, this dandelion root definitely will address that. You can actually make dandelion tea either from the leaf or the root. While leaf is a great diuretic, high in vitamin A, C, potassium, iron, and B vitamins and works very well for kidneys, Root on the other side is high in protein, phosphorus and extremely good for the gut. It really improves the digestive function. It's very good for the heart too as it improves the blood flow. That is exactly the reason why I would say if you're on a blood thinner, you may want to reconsider taking this one or ask your doctor about it. But all in all, amazing health benefit. It is known to reduce stress on the liver. So much so that some bodybuilders take dandelion root to lose water weight just before a competition to get that lean look. It has antibacterial, antifungal and immune boosting properties. Since it's a diuretic, its detoxing nature helps regulate hormones by removing toxins through sweat, urine and bile. Studies also show that sipping on dandelion tea can lower your blood sugar levels, which is critical for keeping diabetes in check. And what's more, it reduces inflammation in the body, which can then lead to many other ailments. Now that we know there's so many positive effects, do you think there's side effects as well? Mm, although it's considered pretty safe to take dandelion tea, but we know no fingers are same. So you may want to consider asking your doctor if you're on blood thinners, like I already told you before. It may interact with certain medications, like if you're on antibiotics or if you're a diabetic, you may want to ask your doctor before you get onto this dandelion tea. As easy as it may be to find a dandelion root tea all over market shelves, it may not necessarily be the best choice for us. Why? Because it could be chemically treated and we don't want that. Now, that's why I choose my brands very, very carefully. And the one that I have chosen this time is a brand called Homegrown Platter Dandelion Root Tea. I did try a few other brands and they were not as good quality as this one. And of course, this video is not sponsored by them, guys. I mean, I I always buy my products and I always uh, promote the products that I personally buy and enjoy using them. So, of course, it's not sponsored, just to clarify. Okay, coming back to the brand, this is an amazing brand. This one from Homegrown Platter Dandelion Root Tea says on the packaging, while harvested and shade dried in high Uttarakhand altitudes, it's 50 grams for 420 rupees, which by no means is cheap. But let me tell you, it's totally worth buying it if you can afford it. Although you can brew it with hot water and some ginger for three to five minutes, but if you roast it and then brew it with hot water and ginger, it releases a nice aroma and tastes even better. So what are you waiting for? It's time to party. <laughs> anyway, I hope you liked this video. I've come to the end of this video. I hope you liked it. If you have tried dandelion tea or any other herbal trees, do leave them in the comment section below. Let's start the communication of knowing good brands through the comments and we can always involve and evolve. And as usual, guys, I'll be seeing you right back on my channel Involve Evolve soon. Namaste.